Hi friends and welcome to Talking with Funny People. My name is host Eric and I am providing today an extroverted intuition test and also a response to a request from my daughter who wanted me to provide her some more of these questions. This is called an Inky Pinky test and typically people with high extroverted intuition in the front stack, that is to say INTPs, INFPs, ENTPs, and ENFPs um, will find these fair, come fairly easily to them and other types will struggle more depending on where your extroverted intuition is. It's not a 100% correlation between extroverted intuition and this test, but it's a pretty good extroverted intuition test. Here are a couple of examples. Hilltop water spout is the clue. We, I'll tell you as well, it's an inky pinky, which means that there are two, two, is, each word in the answer has two syllables. And the answer to that one would be mountain fountain. The second clue, roadway flash. It's an ink pink, it's a one one. Answer, street meat. Okay, so I'm going to provide the following 10. I'm going to read them out loud. And um, what I would encourage you to do, if you'd like to take this test, is to afford yourself about as much time as I pause to see if you can answer it. And if you can't, go on to the next one. See how many you get on the initial rush through. Then go back and maybe give yourself another couple minutes to, to think about them and see how many others you get in, the, in a total of maybe 10 minutes or so. And uh, maybe indicate so in the comments and or if you think you got the answers, put them in the comments as well because I'm not actually going to put the answers up anywhere for right now anyway. I might eventually pen, pen a comment with all the answers in it, but for now I'm going to leave them unanswered. Anyway, here we go. Number one, energetic primate is the clue. It's an inky pinky. Number two, equestrian seat or it's an inky pinky. Number three, lustful gadfly, it's an inky pinky. Number four, crevice teammate, it's an inky pinkety, it's a two three. Number five, a weighty fine, it's an inky pinky, that's Two, two. Number six, a singularly minded judge. Inky Pinky. Number seven, a stroll among pink blossomed poisonous shrubs. This is an Inkitiya Pinkity. It's a four, three. Number eight, a swimming themed Christmas, Inky Pinky. Number nine, a bouncy bush. Oh, this should be a three three, sorry. Inkity Pinkity. Okay. And number 10, last one, an infant footwear donning assistant. Inky, pinky. All right, good luck. And uh, if you've got all of them already, you're probably very high up in extroverted intuition. If you've got a few of them already, you're probably not polar. If you've got none of them already, you might be polar. We'll see what the comments say.